you know, um, I just listened to a conversation of my riders who were actually talking about you know, uh, meeting a girl from a godly family, a girl who came from a well, you know, fashioned, perfect family or whatsoever back home in Nigeria or whatsoever, you know, or wherever, by the way. Um, I'm not having it and I don't like it, you know. See, let it not be as if I'm always against what people say, but the point is that, you know, coming from a godly family does not entail that the girl or the man in question is godly. You know, I want you guys to see this this way. Yeah. So situations and sometimes you see those ladies that came from or their father or their parents are pastors or whatever, they're doing things out of proportion. They something that is so bad, you know? Someone want to find a wife for you because the person come from a godly family. My brother, my sister, <laughs> I knew <laughs> quite very well, oh, that's not, a, <laughs> it's, not a, it's not a guarantee that the so-called lady or the so-called man, <laughs> they were godly, you know? Sometimes <laughs> it could go south everyone has his own life to live everyone you know understand life differently the upgrade upbringing or whatever you call it yes quite all right it could go a long way to affect me somehow but at some point in life it doesn't work like that when you're matured there is always a question to ask the self-identity people tend to live life the way they say it the society they find themselves will affect them differently and when the society are fed them differently, they tend to follow. The peers they, they follow and all that will definitely affect them. You get? So don't put your mind or don't put your eggs in one basket. Oh, she's from the she's from this family. The, the fathers are pastors and you know they are God fearing and all that. Oh god confused. Okay, you qua go job. Okay, you qua go job. That is not the point. Okay, you go job. Because most of the time, these people in H and H and this God-fearing family, they have their own life to live. Oh, but as ye, ye jiggy the real self, and these are the the children. They have their own life. They cannot live the life of their parents, and their parents cannot live their own life in their children. No. I'm not trying to discourage you from settling down with that lady or that man. No, be very very cautious. Be very, very observant. Don't be carried away. Because the moment you're carried away, you might not really see the real person you're dating or the real person they connected you with. You know, uh, the real person they matchmaked you with. And this could go a long way to affect you in that relationship, be it marriage or whatsoever. It could go a long way to affect you. Sometimes you might not come out publicly to tell us what is going on. But we already know what's going on in that, in that relationship you, you find yourself. So guys, ladies, be careful. You cannot expect them to live the same way or live the footstep of your parents. But somehow it's okay because some of them follow the values and the principles. You know, lay down for them. But and don't trust you know without questioning don't trust without you know observing don't trust without you know putting your your mind there use your hand use your head i'm serious about this it's very very important because here are many men who have put her chair say that no because no she's a good family they will marry that person and tomorrow he here go out it's not like that so that you don't fall into the bad and the wrong hand 1960s and 1950s 1970s or 80s or whatsoever is not the same with 20 21 22 23 going up we're in a different dispensation just understand this thank you very much and have a wonderful and blessed day as well so
news from all these my customers i will come down here to you know narrate it you know my point is not as if i need discourage you i discourage you gang i'm just telling you from my own observation from what i think so you might get me wrong you might get me right yotago yagazi zandas merelakumos